Yo, we're in here with Grand Finals. Yes, Got sir. Quit on loser's side, Lingling on winner's side. Your voice is mad loud in my head, by the way. <laughs> mm, the shield pressure. He's scared, bro. My pressure's good. Like, I, I like the, 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 the quick uh, float cancel back airs. It's, like, really hard to pinpoint a lot of, like, aerial moves on Squirtle, but that's, like, so low to the ground that it covers a lot. Yeah, not only that, but it's really hard to challenge because sometimes it just crosses up, so if you commit too hard, you might just get even, uh, be put in an even worse yeah. situation. Especially because, like, our early percent Squirtle's obviously looking for, like, forward tilt, uh, dash grab. Yeah. So those back airs are, like... Oh and Ling does not care about this, uh, upbeat movement. Just throwing out the dare, covering it. Good air dodge to grab the turn up. This is a really precarious situation for Quit to be in this early, but Charizard, big boy, he can. Both of them are pretty much at like the same like level of danger at the moment. Yeah, I guess so. Yep. That, yeah. Jump back are gonna cover the high re high recovery on the side B. Yeah, Quit's just amazing at ledge trapping with every Pokemon. Just reacts, reads everything, puts out hitboxes where yeah. they need to be. That was a quick double up smash from Quid. He got the parry on the first one. Up smash, up smash. Some solid percent. This is really scary. Like Charizard with with Rage is, is is a really scary situation to deal with. Yeah, but it's also really scary for Link to be in the air against Charizard. Um, Charizard just has huge hitboxes, really fast too. Link does, uh, does not want to deal with that at all, especially as a floaty. Okay. Yeah, fishing a bit too hard for the kill. Oh my oh, God! The tip caught. of that back air. He he got caught hovering hovering high like. That's and why the back here with the, the, like, the, the little air. swing art kind of... Yeah. Wow. Good turn up play. Ledge Trump got hit by the turn up and back aired it. That's Still a stitch doable. on deck. He can, he can get big damage off of one conversion here. That stitch... That stitch is about to change the whole game, bro. Hold on. As long as he doesn't... Quinn needs to be careful to not get like a, a ground combo starter. Like That's the scary thing. Like Any of the combo starters on the ground is big damage for Link. But he's just doing so. Oh, oh my god! Break. It's on a platform, the so you can't really get that much. Yeah. Yeah, like, if that was not on a platform, that's more extension after that, but that's but what was, you get uh, on the platform. I was about to say that he was doing a great job just staying on the platform the whole time, shielding, moving around instead of landing on the ground. Yeah. But that shield break just. That was crazy. He just broke. Yeah, this is. Uh, Link, if Link can seal this out without taking too much percent, it's a really good situation for him to, to come back from. I'm sort of like Pikachu right now with those bears. Yep. It was good on Link to DI out to the um, up B wouldn't kill. Ooh. That was almost really nice. Yeah, he went for the tether cancel down air mm -hmm. to cover the recovery, but Link weaved underneath it. Bagger gonna connect on like the last possible hitbox. Link needs to steal out the stock if he has a chance of taking this game. Yeah, he needs this stock, but. Just Ivysaur is just so relentless against Peach. You kind of just don't ever feel like you have the right chance to land against this character. Here we go with Charizard again. Ooh, that, that should throw? be the stock. Up throw might be the stock. Yep, for sure. Even without Rage, it probably would have killed. Yeah. That was that was a pretty dominant game one. Obviously, Ling won on on winner side. So you have to see how this how this shakes out. I don't know, I, Ling's just, the first set, reset of Grands is just always like anyone's game. Yeah, especially because the person who's been running through loser side is... Uh, they want it more, you know? Well, they also have, they're, they're, they've been warm, they've been playing the whole time. True. Whereas Winner's Final was quite a bit ago. Like, Yeah, but also uh, Ling just has a chance to like reset his mentality yeah. and study uh, quit a bit more. Mm -hmm. So it goes both ways. Yep. I like the attempt to drag now. I like the good little start there. Like the, the difference between that start and last start is uh, Quid's like, all right, I understand now that being on the platform is where I want to start. And Leon is like, okay, where I'm going to throw a turn if it's like the combo up there. Yep. Chasing him, brain trapping with that bear. Now, uh. This now the quit. main characters here. Yeah, quit. this is actually quit off Squirtle or kind of earlier than he normally would be. I think he's understanding that Ling just has a rough time dealing with Ivysaur in general. And he, uh... Oh, wait, hold on. No, that's a stop. That's a stop. Wow, that was super unfortunate. 
But yeah. as I was saying, like... I don't think he turned around the up B. I I think turn around up B would have uh, snapped ledge with uh, the tether. But he might have just gone too low. Well. Yeah, I feel like Squirtle does well against Peach, but... Um, sometimes you just get, like... You just can't really push advantage as hard as a as a Ivy Sword. That up air just does numbers on Peach. Well, Daisy. You know that move. You know that move is like mad fast for no reason. Oh, oh, Saturn on deck. Oh wow, hold on. This is scary. If I were, oh, I would jump. I know Ling. At those percents, kind of just likes to throw away Saturn sometimes yeah. because he sees it more as a threat than as a like a helpful tool. But uh, dying for no reason. Saturn's a comeback factor, and if and if you're winning, there's no reason to give yourself the added risk. Yeah. Wow. Pick a grab, gonna nice snatch up that side B. That might be it. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Up throw, up throw up air. Remember when they found out about that like <laughs> half a year ago? They were like, wait, up throw. Up air works, and we were like, yes. Absolutely. Wow. All of a sudden, just like there's kind of there's been like a lot of tether cancel things from Quid, and it always seems like like Lin's like ready for the one that he did just two seconds ago, and there's, there's just another one in the bag. Yeah, it's just the mix up will win a mix up. Wow, that hitbox is ginormous. If I, I were turn Ling, up on him. I want to see some Z drop stuff. Okay. If I were Ling, I wouldn't even be fishing for the kill right now. I'd just be uh, hoping that he uh, kind of leaves himself open a bit, plucks some turnips. Yeah, that's just rough. He's gonna forward throw because he doesn't want to stale the up throw. Okay. Hundred percent. Really need something big starter here. I was sort. Might just like finish this off. He, he wants to stay grounded right now, but uh, at the same time, could just ooh, wow, Caught brain a trap. Yep. Couldn't do anything. And this is such a rough situation. He's trying to shark. Uh, I was on the platform with the up airs, and the problem there is he can kind of wait. And then if you're if you're constantly trying to up air with the sharking seems good. But down air is going to convert. Like at that percent, down air will convert. It'll put you high enough off the, up the above the platform for you to get punished. Mm. I really would like to see something other than PS2. I I, I don't think it's the correct. I I swear there's there, there's something better than PS2. I think. I wonder what the bands are. The bands probably. The bands are for sure Smashville and Yoshi's. I got 10 billion on uh, <laughs> me, Shake, yeah. Shake Chat. They're side betting. <laughs> All right, so we got game three. This time, Quid gets the first opening. That's just kind of how it goes, really. Now, just how do you land? That's the real question. Wow, 20%. All right. It's just like they're both just taking their time, but at the same time, I said time again. <laughs> but they both want to get something started. But both players are just so patient. It's just whoever approaches first is probably gonna get messed up. But they, they do a lot of space coverage, but but. Quid's definitely swinging. He's he swung a, a fair amount, but it's it's his conversions are just a bit more on point right now. Pivot grab, grab. Up throw. Not gonna take it just yet. The more Ling loses, the more he wants to get something started, which creates more openings for uh, Quid. So this is just a rough situation. He's a good read. A good ledge trap right now, actually. Yeah, Yo, yep. he got the ledge hog back air. Oh, well, ledge cards are backer. heavy. Nice. Porter is not going to take it just yet. More turnips. Same These catches are amazing. Stitch on deck, actually. These are some really good catches, though. Up he was able to now. live because of it, and then got the stock first. <laughs> what a grab! It, it was just like uh, just, oh, back here going to take back it. Back here. He, he was just like barely not like 
So he'd air dodge, catch the first turnip, and the second turnip would never get there in time. He's always understage by time the second turnip was getting thrown. On the ledge now. Scariest position to be uh, in against Quid, in my opinion. Try to read an air dodge, maybe? looking for that down tilt right now. Yeah. Looking for down anything, tilt's really. The, the big damage starter. And then and the other situation is down tilt's a really good option in this because you know Squirtle's Ooh. trying to like the approach and footsie. Wow. You. I can't believe he missed that. Well, Quid's like, I don't care about your mix-up on my shield with your float. Just grab. That was a good uh, holding down on the upbeat to hit Quid with Parasol. Float cancel Tomahawk. Down smash, that was actually a nice. really strange option. Yeah. I really like it. Oh, I don't know that the DI was quite there yet, but that F-Tilt gonna no, take that, it. That definitely would have killed even with good DI, in my opinion, but... Yeah, that side B has no lag. Every time I try and punish it, it's like F-Smash to your face, dash attack, or whatever. Ling Ling slowly... S slowly... Uh, kind of just calming down, which uh, you can kind of see, but I don't know. This this set might just be over, and we might be moving into true finals. No, just as I say that, he gets in there. It's on Squirtle again. I just like any any big combo starter in the game is pretty much even, but Quid's been doing a very good job of, of avoiding the down tilt. Yeah, shielding that down tilt yep. too. This is this is a tough situation. Nice, 29%. Oh, but gets gets under stage again. That should be it. Yup. Wow. Hold on. Immaculate DI. He has no choice but to go to ledge. He can't go high. The Ivy Sword up there is so threatening. This is, oh, oh my god, I was about to say this is still winnable. He but. actually he actually tried to cover like he, he was purposely covering like like roll away and barely missed the, the like uh, punish on him rolling in. Mm -hmm. And then got platform drop up air for it and took the stock. True finals reset, we're back into zero zero situation. I have a Let's feeling see. that this might be like one of those uh tense game five situations. <laughs> I don't know. These catches have just been so good from Quinn. Even off stage and on stage. Just always ready to catch it. Making the turn up do uh, work for him. Landing uh, it, just throwing off Ling Ling. Okay. Wow. Another stitch on that. He lost oh, but it's it. gone. That could have been a lot. These side yeah, You can see, like, Quid almost didn't take very much percent until he swapped to Ivysaur. I think the swap to Ivysaur, like, I think Ivysaur is definitely, like, better in the offensive, but on defense, he's, he's doing a very good job of Squirtle of not taking very much percent. Yeah, it's just a case of Squirtle being faster, but at the same time, um, I feel like Ling doesn't really fear the Squirtle yeah. um, that much. He, I think he really has just an issue with um, Ivysaur and Charizard. Because he just can't play his um, his air game as hard. He has to stay a bit more grounded. Side so gonna take Barely it. Killing. That was good. That was good because he kept air dodging uh, the back air attempts. So side is a little more of a delayed hitbox in the kind of same area. So he caught the air dodge there by side being because it was slower. Wasn't it a roll? Maybe I saw it wrong. I, might have been a roll, but he, the the previous uh, back airs were definitely getting uh, air dodge to ledge. Okay. <laughs> Let's little look still. But uh, right now, this is oppor the opportunity for uh, Ling to really just survive for a bit because he dies to up air, but he doesn't really die to a confirm right now. So the same this situation, is Ling's chance. Knowing that uh, Quid needs to seal out the stock is like uh, it's like your just best bet at getting a big in. opener. Mm -hmm. Like knowing that he's gonna swing. The percent. 
Maybe not. Up up here. These Pokemon players just, switch uh, avoids the bear. These players just never really stay in the in the center. They're always um they're always just on ledge. Either one's just always being ledge trapped. Kind of ridiculous. That was a really good pivot grab. Dash back to bait the chase. Ooh. What a what Downer a punish. Up there. Oh my lord. On the whiff punish. It's fantastic. That was amazing. Another Saturn. Saturn? This is scary, but. I actually if, think this uh, is a situation where Saturn can play a really big role in Moon getting an opening here. Wow. Custom combos. <laughs> Ooh. I think that's just what we've been seeing a lot. Just Quid just doesn't care about the turnips. Like this whole set just. He's guys confident not enough in his, in his item play to make it work just as much for him. Oh, he does have that pack man. Oh my god. Up smash gonna take it. Don't miss that rapid jab. <laughs> that was uh, F smash angled up actually. But Oh yeah, sorry. 48 on the ledge. 62 with turnip. Okay. Unfortunate for Ling uh, down there sending the wrong way. Oh man. The same conversion from the last stock. I think I think Quid just has like a good read on uh on when to like escape Link Shield pressure now. At least with Ivysaur. Link's gonna have to start um Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I I think they has to like at least try something other than PS2. Yeah, I mean uh, I'm not sure why he went only PS2 the past few games because there's just so much space for um for Quid to run around with. Um, but at the same time, I know Link doesn't like the the cheese possibility on stages like these. H higher higher ceiling might work in his favor a bit too. Ooh. The early ledge trapping. Might see a switch to Ivysaur. Yup, there it is. <sighs> that hitbox yeah, is <laughs> too big. <laughs> that parasol hitbox hit from Narnia. What a mix. Shield poking at the end. It's just... Ling's always just like a step behind. I'm unsure why he went Battlefield exactly, um, but I know that he definitely prefers um, Sharking on this stage for sure because of the platforms. Okay. <laughs> Side B tried to cover that roll. Nice forward air. Okay, we have some ledge trap. He needs to get something here. <laughs> it's just so tense. You don't okay. really know what they're gonna do next. I'm kind of okay with that trade, even though that trade, like, uh, I don't like uh, quit getting center stage for free. And so even if you get a trade hit, it's not particularly great. Wow. Yeah, back here. Yeah, even Quid's just one of those players that once you're like not holding center, you're not getting it back for a while, and it's just really scary uh, and hard to deal with. No punish on that. Yeah, I think it was Dust a little matches. too far out for a Z drop to work. Mm -hmm. So he's looking for a different mix after that. He's I just, thought he was going to go for back air at ledge. He's just looking for anything right now. Ooh, but getting the back air. We keep saying this 65% isn't um, isn't really much for Peach to make up, but when but Quiz is just yeah. not getting hit at all by these turnips, by these nares, then it really does mean a lot. And that Sox is gone. Peach is usually one of those characters where it's like, oh, it's still anyone's game, but just the evasiveness just kind of denies all that because it doesn't matter if uh, you can get the combo, but you can't get the hit in to start it. So ready to um, call out these approaches, these grabs, these landing nares. 
he even covered like right there after uh, Ling was on ledge. He did Nair, landing there, and jabbed in the opposite direction to cover roll. So he rolled in and he's getting caught with the shot. Done. Up B. Six, what was that, 68? Yeah. No way. Oh. Nerfed, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> nerfed. Yeah, I'm pretty... I don't think they nerfed the power. They just nerfed, like, the sweet spot. He's taking a small break. Oh. Yeah. One second. Wants here. water. Ling grabbing a water real quick. We're, we're getting into <coughs> what is Ling's tournament life on. It, it could he could go down three out here, but yeah. Uh, Miles Pizza. saying Quid realized the answer to Peach is more Zard. I think I agree because I think when uh, not only does he live longer, which is usually what matters a lot, but he just seems to be getting way more meaningful punishes from uh, Ling's approaches when he's Zard. Just earlier kills, um, more percent. It's kind of yep. crazy, but... Um, I mean, those last... The, the, I'm pretty sure all three stocks in that game were actually Vine with, but definitely Charizard has, like, stopped him from, like, losing uh, his stocks early. Like, he doesn't stay on Ivysaur, and then it's a real struggle for Link to take the stock off of Ivysaur. It, uh, off of Charizard. it also just puts more mental uh, pressure on Link to, like hit something raw instead of uh, being able to just comfortably uh, fish for the kill. Yeah. Floating above. Yeah, Squirrel just kind of has to wait for uh, Peach to land in those situations. Barely missing. Puts reactions to the- ooh, that's a stock. That down air gonna take it so early. Yep, that parasol is big, but not Ivysaur down air big. Yeah, I wonder if this is the power up. Link switch the peach for the daisy. Maybe. He got the water too, but so far it's more like a power down right now. All right, I'm never gonna make a joke like that again. <laughs> I apologize. Winky face on deck. We need some damage here. Take the, take the stock I'm, with, with I'm tired. The I'm tired of these situations where they're both two stocks. Ling's at 63, and it's like, oh, it's it's one it, combo, yeah, it, it and then it's like, even, but it's, no, but it's like, not like giving it's, up those early percents. It's just like, oh, one one combo, and it's like he doesn't hit him at all, and then he loses his stock, and then he's just playing behind the whole time. Quit throwing out even the downs. Wow. Oh. Pop the roll in, he, he baby with double double razor leaf. You know Pop when he up, down right? smashes that ledge that he's feeling it. Yeah. Mm. Around these parts we call that the Nokum. Man loves his Ivysaur F smash at ledge. Mm. As he should. Great option. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright. Wow. Yeah, he's just like. This is my tournament, you know. This is so tough. What do you do here? When Quid doesn't need to approach you, it's just and you're playing a slow character like Peach, it's just a question of of like when do I get in? Yep. And it's like you don't. That normally wouldn't be a problem, but Quid's just shown that he does not care about the turnips. So he, oh, that's why Ling's just not using them as much, just kind of running in normally. That was almost the set. Yeah, that could have been it. Don't get up, beat. Ooh, hold on. Nair? Nah, not from across the stage. Oh. The air dodge too low there to get some Winnable, it back. winnable. Wait, is that a dot eyes? No, it's not. Nah. Oh. So much pressure. <laughs> Good on Link to. to what uh, a spot dodge. That's not it. Pivot Hold ground. on. Oh my not god. They're so close. I, th I think. <gasps> That's it. Yup. Yep. Quid was extremely dominant. That yeah, was. It's just a. Uh, 
That was a grand final. A clean 6-0 sweep. Not many people get to say that. They just 6-0 Ling. 